to go. We hear the whistle of Fisher. Real Salt Lake kicks us off. And for the first time this year, FC Dallas and Real Salt Lake get together. Later on this year, they will play at Rio Tinto. Deep Gresso sat with Ecuador. He very rarely pushed into the attack. And we've seen a few times with FC Dallas where he's pushed up. He had that one shot off the post earlier this year. He's no stranger to getting up, and I think Oscar Preja wants him to push in the attack with Ecuador. Boy, he when was staying right behind that back line. Oh, quick restart here. This is going to put Barrios in on goal. Perfectly timed run from Michael Barrios there. The whole back line for RSL Napping. As we said, two players making their first MLS starts of the season tonight. Kellen Acosta gets his goal. The easiest one he'll probably ever score. Well, it's his first one since October 4th against Houston. 3 to 2006. Now the right side, Barrios across in and away. Diaz takes it a flexion. It's just one ball to spring Barrios down that right wing. He spots Diaz making the late run at the top of the box. It was destined for goal. A great clearance by Hamas and Olave. About Mulholland's long range shot. Nobody closed him down. Ball's whipped in here. Clearance right to the middle, though, by Walker Zimmerman. Now Holness! And that looked really dangerous. Oh, certainly the best attack of the first half from Real Salt Lake. No one steps up to Holness. They dare him to shoot. And he nearly finds that far corner. Wow. You wonder if we might see Tesho Akindele coming off the bench in not too long. He's made a big impact for FC Dallas off the bench. Uh, here's Castillo. Oguan is back. Castillo goes in. And Castillo got it. From Mauro Diaz to spring Fabian Castillo one on one down the wing. The bicycle kick from Diaz, unbelievable to find Fabian Castillo. He cuts it onto his left foot, right foot, excuse me. Brilliant shot, fourth goal of the season for Fabian Castillo. Individual brilliance from two individually brilliant players. Now Uyoa is on as Victor will just slot in and sit in front of the pack four and help FC Dallas see out this match. Up from right back as Harris clips the ball out. Oh! And a sneaky little header from Tesho Akadeli. Forces Akadeli into a save. He's able to bat it over the bar. That good, was clever. Good work from Atiba Harris down that right side for FC Dallas. Tesho kind of established his position there in the box on Olave. Said a really nice opportunity there. Well done from Tesho Akindele to force the save. Hard to. And that's it. The three points. Write them down now for FC Dallas. Hugs on the touchline for Oscar Perea, the staff.